The cross plane is a tool to visualize the inside of a three dimensional solid model. The example on the screen is a heat conduction model. The contour image represents the temperature distribution on the outer surfaces of the model. The temperature distribution inside the volume can be represented by contour images projected on the cross planes. Before demonstrating the cross plane tool, let's review the clipping plane tool, which is demonstrated in another tutorial titled Clipping Plane. The interior temperature contours are imaged on a clipping plane, whose position and direction can be manipulated interactively. The cross plane tool is similar to the clipping plane tool, but differently from the case of a single clipping plane, the cross plane tool visualizes the inside of the volume using the image of three orthogonal planes. Each of the planes can be moved independently by placing the screen cursor over the plane and dragging it. The face direction of a plane can be rotated by dragging one of its edge lines. A corner point of the plane can also be dragged along a model box edge. The orthogonality between the planes is always maintained, regardless of the position and orientation of the planes. The intersection point of the cross planes is designated as cross point. The numerical figures in the text boxes of the tool panel indicate the position of the cross point. The numerical values can be represented optionally either by the x, y, z coordinates, or, by the relative position within the model boundaries. One of the two options can be selected from, by coordinates, and, by ratio, items, in cross menu. The current setting is, by coordinates. Thus, the x, y, z coordinates of the cross point are continuously updated, while a cross plane is being moved. The coordinates of the cross point can be specified by inserting the numerical values in the text boxes. Press Enter key. Then, the cross point moves to the specified position. By ratio, item in cross menu switches the option to the relative position, represented by three ratios. Accordingly, the coordinates are converted to Rx, Ry, and Rz which are the three ratios representing the relative positions of the cross point. Change the numerical values in the text boxes to the ratio values, representing the desired position, and press Enter key. Then, the cross point moves to the position specified by the ratios. Reset planes item of cross menu recovers the initial state of the cross planes, which is equivalent to relative position, represented by three values of 0.5. One, or more of the cross planes can be excluded selectively, by unchecking the corresponding item in cross menu. For example, X Y and Y Z cross planes are excluded, and only the Z X plane is maintained for contour image. The excluded planes are recovered consecutively by checking the corresponding items in cross menu. Pressing the control key hides the blue lines of the bounding box, and the red lines of cross planes. Although the red lines are hidden, the cross planes can be moved or dragged as usual. Pressing the control key again makes the blue and red lines visible. The instant update option makes the cross planes refreshed instantly, while being manipulated. This option can be turned off, by choosing instant update item from the menu. Then, manipulation of the cross planes is not instantly refreshed, and updated at the end of moving or dragging. The cross planes are kept facing frontward, while, the model view is being rotated. Accordingly, the displayed part of the model is switched, so that the cross planes may always face frontward. Thus, all the cross planes are imaged with the contours, regardless of the model orientation. We may change the form of rendering the boundary surfaces, while, maintaining the contour image, on the cross plane. The boundary surface can be rendered as a wireframe by choosing wireframe item from render menu. Or, as an outline representation by choosing outline item. Or, as a shaded image by choosing shaded image item.
This is the end of the tutorial for the cross-plane tool of Visual FEA.